How y'all doing? I'm going to talk about the killer kids, ages 13 and 14. Why do we have the killer kids in the black community? Okay, it's, you know what? It's plenty more where that came from. You can probably Google and get umpteen cases where kids have shot someone else. They either shot their parents, shot a relative, or shot their brothers and sisters, uh, shot a lot of people. Okay? But I'm going to talk about this particular case that happened a few days ago about these killer kids, uh, ages 13 and 14, two black kids. Uh, they went in a, um, I guess it was outside of maybe a school library, I don't know, but they shot this other 13-year-old kid. And come to find out that the ones who, the lady who got them to kill this 13-year-old kid was a Hispanic woman, probably Central American. Let's just say Central American. She got this 13 and 14-year-old black kid to kill this 13-year-old Hispanic Mexican kid. And they did it. They did it. Okay. First of all, why did she get two black kids? Because black kids, we all know black children are expendable. Their lives don't matter. Black lives matter. I mean, matter to whom? No, it doesn't. See, that's the totally wrong slogan. Okay. Because black lives don't matter to us and don't matter to other people either. Because black people kill other other children. What about these all these babies being killed by bullets and stuff? Black people don't even value their own lives of other kids. So how do you expect the other people to value the lives of black children? She got these this Hispanic woman got these two black kids, the age thirteen and fourteen, to kill this other Mexican kid, thirteen years old. Now why did she get black kids? Because black kids are expendable, their lives don't count. Okay, so she got them to do it. And see, look. The black man now is not thinking but a half a cup of his brains. These 13 and 14 year old kids, they're not even thinking about what, thinking but they're only using one eighth of the brain, which is what, about a tablespoon full of brain. They're gonna do just what this Hispanic woman tells them to do, this Central American Hispanic woman tells them to do. Go kill this thir other 13 year old Mexican kid. They're not gonna think, okay, well maybe I shouldn't do that. I'm gonna tell my parents that would have been, and then my parents can call the police. Or I just go directly to the police. I'll call the number and tell them if somebody wants me to kill someone. So what are you going to do? What should I do about it? They don't tell their parents. And, and, and look, that's the, the thing. That's why there's so many derelict parents. You don't even know where your 13 and 14 year old kids. Well, he's on the street. Well, guess what? He's about to kill somebody. That's where your 13, 14 year old kid is. Because you're, you're too lazy. You're busy looking at BET. You're too lazy to go find out where your child is. You're too lazy to do that. Well, guess what? Your 13, 14 year old, he's up to no good. He's out there killing another 13, 14 year old because you're too lazy to, you're watching BE2 and getting your hair done. You're getting your braids put in, put in so you don't have time to watch your 13, 14 year old. Well, guess what? Some derelict Mexican woman told your son to go kill another kid and he did it. See, these kids aren't even thinking about what? Eighth, one eighth of the brain. These, they followers. Someone tells them to go kill, they go kill. They follow us, just like they're older, older black um, males. Uh, the older black males are followers. Do you want me to jump in the lake? Find the lake. Find out where the lake is. They only, even, even today's black youth only think with one fourth of the brain. The 13, 14 you only think with one eighth, which is about a tablespoonful. So you look, these young people, they followers, just like robots, pu the puppets. They let this white, they let this Hispanic woman be a puppet master over their lives and say, go kill the 13, 14 year old, they did. Killer kids, why? It's you derelict parents. Y'all not teaching your sons and daughters to think. Y'all derelict for letting this happen. For letting some woman tell your, tell your son to go kill somebody else. You a derelict parent. Bye.